I believe the cost goes up for resting in the inn based on how much you your character's level. Spider critter. So you can look at their animation to see what their aggro is. Red, yellow is their passive control route. Red means they're, they're coming at you. Bro. And you notice when the character you target dies, it does retarget the target. Back rank enemy, but we bring back front and back rank characters. Which, so that means you can build the rank from the back rank and the rank attacks and all the things are turned into one. So nobody's leveled up yet. Inventory slots and based on who you give stuff to, inventory, to inventory slots. So, yeah. It isn't like other RPGs where you have unlimited inventory. And so, like Slime's Goo. Ah, so, the, so this is a healing item, which is good. But not everything like that is. Some things don't have immediate use, and they might be a material item, or they might be just something to sell. Some of these games they will grade you as part of information based on how far, how much the dungeon you've actually mapped. It's around here somewhere. Can't go through that door at this time. There's a monster on the side of that door. Nice. Okay. actually directly come up to them yourself rather than have them come up on you and then they have surprise around. Start battles Fight them or 
kill anything. But it built my trust with one of my party members. Good ideas. Okay, this is the little test aggro more how whether or not they're hostile. These guys are actually hostile. This is everything in the back. Get a drop. Yes, we do. Pixie's wing. What does Pixie's wing do? Potion. Okay, that might actually be worth the first thing to be able to be a lot of potential to level up next. That was enough to heal up Kyoto full. Okay, that worked pretty well. Over there. 
Orc first because these guys are epic because it doesn't do any more damage. That's where we get to the risk reward ratio is hey, like one more fight like that, I'll level up. Well, I don't take a bite by the dust. It's new into this, something different about the room. Local boxes were lined neatly before the desk, and the carpet was rolled out as to welcome guests. The room contained a sense of liveliness, something that did not exist in the labyrinth. Though this is a safe room, somewhat. difference from actual D&D. &D. In actual D&D, &D, you get it, unless your GM is a dick, which admittedly, the wizardry GM is a dick, you get XP for, for creatures you beat, no matter what. Well, the beat, but if creatures you overcome. You talk your way past a problem, you get, the, you scare the enemy into running away, and they choose not to be a threat, and like, they don't run away and regroup, they just run, or whatever, you get XP for it. Here, not so much. Alright, so, we now have two characters who have leveled up. So let's 
fall back. Save the potions for later because. Assassination ability. Okay. Sauce. Unidentified chest plate. Now let's give some reason to head back to town then. Rest up and save my game. Okay, so still, so still only 150. That's good. Some games, this levels up. So, like, if everyone's level 2, and it's like, say, $50 to 50 gold times your level, then it'd be 100 gold now. Then it would be like 300 gold now because everyone's level 2. Doesn't do that. So, as you can see, not every stat is going up. Evade hasn't gone up for either of these characters. The evade boosting item I have, I believe, is a temporary buff. Regular chest plate, but that boosts my defense considerably. All right, so they have that. Well, not well, not considerably. It drops my evade by one, but my defense by but my defense by one. So I'm more likely to get a hit, but I'll take less damage when I do. It lets me tank a little better. Yeah, sure. So you can see they don't sell expendable op um, items here. Evade. 
and then we sell the liver armor. Um, let me here. Can I? Yeah, you can't. Un unlike in other wizardry games, in wizardry legs, you can do equips and, ch and shuffle items around in the, in the shop, but you can't do that here. Let's sell the other armor. Four hundred gold. Yeah, that's actually pretty good starting ca pretty good cash to clear up. Appointments were fairly early in the game, and unless you have created a uh, spell a healer yourself, you do not have a healer with you. So next fight, Keo levels up and we'll fall back to town. In fact... Explore the next chamber and... Left my life just ahead. Now it's all in the past, but I still can't seem to forget that fear. I will encourage him. It's already caused the necessary worry. Don't worry about it. We're a team. Hey, Durgan, don't you think we should go where Kia almost died? He avoided that place, you'll never be able to recover from your fear of the past. Okio, where is that place? Keep going straight ahead, there should be an altar in a snowy area. Where the altar is where I was laying. Got it, the snowy altar, right? What are we waiting for? Also, Ricardo, this is if this area is really snowy, have you considered maybe pants? Also, those I built up trust with both characters there. Easily, go to town easily, use a transfer potion. You'll be there instantly. A mighty warrior, Odom. Thanks for the tooltip, Odom. Reporters. Oh, 
gosh, what should I do? The priestess stood bored in the room. Huh? You're the one. You met at the lodge, right? Are you here to get a pass also? Maybe? Yes. I will, I, I will smile and nod. I see, but nobody's here right now. I'm pretty sure this is the room to get a pass. I've been waiting for a while, but nobody's shown up. What should I do now? The party members I hired just took their money and ran. This totally sucks. Looks like you don't even have a priest with you. How about a deal? If you allow me and your party, I think we'll both benefit from each other. Yes, please! We don't have a healer. I'm relieved that you all seem like really nice people. Okay, we've got a deal. I'm Sarah McDuff. Nice to meet you. Sarah joined your party. Also, Sarah has a per Sarah's character design has her midwiff exposed, which seems really impractical, both from a armor stand from a protecting yourself standpoint and a wooden box. But I can't pick up the letter to read it from a general. and the warm skin. It's like a button that lets me just... I want to make the map bigger. Ah, so what level E is Sarah? Sarah's level 1. Her offense, but she's a back. Oh, so, going dagger, it's a back rank weapon. Healing staff is a front rank weapon and boosts her spellcasting ability. People have fallen for my bait. Boss monster? Oh, thieves. Monsters, so this is actually a surprise attack. Oh, four damage. Sarah has a lot more to level up before she reaches level 1. But Kyo has leveled up. Hmm. Interesting. A small shield under the corpse. Ah, uh, sure. Small steel shield. The only person belonged to was engraved in the shield. Scott Bain, the wolf of Gascon. Those thieves must have killed him. Ricardo, hold on. Can I take a look at that shield? God held the shield and gazed at the engraved name. Ricardo approached the dead body and crouched down. He examined the body and looked for something. I thought so. 
dead body. He was the leader of the team I used to be with. I had no idea he was dead. He wasn't somebody who would get killed easily by thieves. That's sad that he doesn't even have someone to clean his body, especially when it's this close to town. What a pity. I really wanted to come confront him because he was the one who kicked me out. But it's strange now, nothing will come out of my mouth now that he's right in front of me. And, damn, I wanted to teach him a lesson one of these days. Sorry guys, I didn't mean to get you guys involved. And everyone gets a boost, and it's probably going to be closer to completing a Ricardo's quest. Heal Ricardo, because he's at half HP. We just search for this room. So he has leveled up, or has, has enough XP to level up, so let's head back to town. It'll be a while until Sarah levels up. So I'll probably get some fights on the way back in here. Any difference here? Nope. No, it's a safe room. But we want much more information about that. Now, those are XP for these guys are going down because they're a lower level compared to our general average party. Also, we have more people in the party.
was like 50 bucks per party member. Okay. Everyone except defense. Everything except defense leveled up, and including uh, hit points and in particular agility and luck. That's good. Now they got a new party member. Let's save the game. 